everybody welcome back to our channel or welcome if you're new I am Stephanie and you are watching Steffi K's farm family if you're new here I am a stay-at-home wife and homeschooling mama to four little kiddos um, our family does rodeoing and barrel racing my son team ropes we just got lots of farm stuff going on uh, we have a 90 acre horse and cattle farm we do have goats and chickens and um, a rabbit named Chicken Nugget. And the reason he's named Chicken Nugget is because he is the same color as a Chicken Nugget. So my daughter named him Chicken Nugget. Anyway, uh, today I have a grocery haul for you. I am on my way to get myself some gas because we were supposed to have some really bad weather this weekend. Usually I do not let my car get below a, a half of a tank and it's on a fourth of a tank right now. So I'm going to fill my expedition up. Hold on, I got somebody coming towards me and they probably think I'm crazy. Maybe I am. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm gonna stop and fill up with gas. I'm gonna stop at the Dollar General. And I was gonna go to the town that's like 45 minutes away that has an Aldi, but I don't feel like going that far today. So I am running, and you'll just have to excuse my hair. I just got out of the shower a few minutes ago and throwed myself together just a little bit. So I um, got some wild hair going on. Anyway, I'm gonna be stopping at the Piggly Wiggly too and picking up what I need. I don't have a whole lot that I need. Well, it's quite a bit, but we're a family of six, so it takes a lot to feed us. Uh, I've got my grocery list here with me. I'm not going to show it to you right now because I'm trying to drive. And uh, I do have a meal plan for you, so stay tuned to the end of this video. And um, I will have that up for you. And I will see y'all when I get back home. Alright, just filled up with gas. I am not happy with this. How much are gas prices where y'all live? It was two ninety eight at hours, or at the, the gas station that's nearest to us. Like I said, I had a quarter of a tank. Um, it took sixty eight dollars to fill my car up, which I don't go a whole lot of places during the week. I mostly do my running around on the weekend um, when we have to. So this tank of gas. In my expedition, it's the big expedition, it's the EL. Um, it'll last me probably about a month. Sorry, I'm having to watch the road. I'm on the highway now. Um, I'm just not happy with gas prices. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get off my soapbox now. I gotta stop at the dollar store now. <laughs> I am back from the grocery store. No, it is not three hours later, Caden. Four o'clock, you left it too. I did not. All right, anyway, um, it was crazy. Like I said, we're supposed to be getting some nasty weather. We're supposed to be having some ice and then some snow. And y'all know everybody needs their milk and bread sandwiches. So, I was just going for my weekly groceries. It's Friday. And I go usually on Friday or Saturday for weekly groceries. This was not a milk and bread sandwich kind of run. It was crazy. I should have just went on to the other town that I was going to go to. Because, oh my heavens alive. I didn't get half the stuff for... It, the price was ridiculous. It's crazy. Anywho, um, I stopped at the Piggly Wiggly and I stopped at the Dollar General. So I'm going to turn you around and show you what I got um, at my Piggly Wiggly or for my Piggly Wiggly haul. This is for a week's worth of groceries. This is just kind of an overview of this is all I got at the Piggly Wiggly. And it was $158. $158. Anyway, here's what all I got. I got a cheese stuffed crust pizza for pizza night tonight. Um, it's a pepperoni one. And then I got a rising crust supreme one. These were like only, a, I think this one was seven something, seven ninety four, and I think this one was five ninety nine. So that's not too bad because those were pretty big pizzas. Those are later. Okay, Caden's going to set out hay. And Shawler's got to go hip him. And she's not happy about it. <laughs> okay. Back to the groceries. Um, I got some a bag of Golden Delicious apples. 
they had the gallon size of buttermilk. I go through a lot of buttermilk for my biscuits and cornbread and stuff like that. Uh, my coffee creamer, vanilla caramel. This stuff is so good. Uh, the I love their creamer there. And the dogs are fighting in the background. Mini Pearl won't leave Helga alone. <laughs> I got a bunch of bananas, some mini cucumbers, um, a pack of uh, sliced cheese. And these are, you'll see it on my menu plan. I got two of the little, these are like a dollar a piece. They're like personal size pizzas. Uh, two cheeseburger pizzas, two sausage pizzas. I think I got two sausage. Yeah, two sausage pizzas and one supreme. They didn't have any plain cheese. I'm telling you, they were about out of a lot of stuff, and I think it's just because of the the snow and ice that is supposed no, to hit. And then I got two things of the mild Tennessee Pride sausage. It's frozen, so <laughs> it was already frozen from the store. Uh, two packages of sweet hickory smoked bacon. The brine, they had that on sale. Uh, two packages of the imitation crab. My kids like this in melted butter with garlic salt in it. It is good. Uh, the uh, lunch meat this week, I got smoked turkey. This is just the Land of Frost smoked turkey. I think it is 18 ounces right here. Uh, cheese, I got a thing of sharp, fancy shredded sharp cheddar cheese. Junk food, I got dinosaur bites. That's the cheapest one they have. And then this looked really good, so I thought we might try it. Um, my husband's drinks, I got a 24 pack of Pepsi. Schaller wanted a Mountain Dew, so I got a two liter Mountain Dew. Uh, 10 pound bag of potato, no, that's an eight pound bag. Oh my word. You can get a 10 pound bag at Aldi for half of what I paid for this. <sighs> Should have went to Aldi, I guess. I just didn't feel like it at the time. Wish I had to listen to myself and went on. Uh, a package of real bacon pieces. Caden was about out of hot sauce, so I got some Texas Pete hot sauce. We were almost out of salsa, so I got some pecani sauce. Pretty much the same thing as salsa. We were completely out of banana peppers. The kids like these like on salads, sandwiches, whatever. I put them on homemade pizzas when I do that. I lazied myself out tonight and didn't do homemade pizza. Should have. So I got two jars of banana peppers. Uh, I was completely out of Worcestershire sauce. So I got a bottle of it. I use that in my sloppy joe, meatloaf, whatever. Uh, butter, pancake, and waffle syrup. I've been craving rice checks, so I got myself some more rice checks. Caden's favorite crackers. Cheddar cheese, the Munchies Cheetos, cheddar cheese crackers. I got four packs of those. They had them two for four dollars. So that's a better price on that than anywhere else. Uh pure vegetable oil. I got 64 ounces of it because I was completely out of cooking oil. Um whoo, did y'all see that? <laughs> A 10 pound bag of sugar. Oh, if I can get it over here. Yeah, there you go. 10 pound bag of sugar. I think it's 10 pounds. Yeah, 10 pound bag of sugar. And two of the White Lily Unbleached Self Rising Flour. Because I was out of the, almost out of the self rising. I think I have one more bag of these. I like to keep these in the freezer. They keep really well in the freezer. And then my husband needed some more distilled water for his CPAP machine that he has to sleep with at night. So I got him two gallons of distilled water. And that is all I got at Piggly Wiggly. All right, y'all, here is my Dollar General haul. I got a big case of purified drinking water, two gallons of milk so we can have our milk and bread sandwiches when the snow and ice hits. Uh, cereal this week, we have Honey Nut Toasted Oats, Cocoa Crispy Rice, and Frosted Shredded Wheat. My kids love shredded wheat. I know that's kind of unusual, but they do. Uh, this is for movie night. I just got the powdered sugar donuts and then these. I saw these. I wonder how they taste. Strawberry Cheesecake Donuts. Mm-mm-mm. Uh, bread this week. We got two packages of hamburger buns and I don't have a clue I guess that just got mispackaged because all eight buns are in place and there's like an extra squished bun down there uh, Hot dog buns 
two things of white bread chips this week we have hickory barbecue wavy lays and i saw these i thought we would try these uh kick and dill ranch dill pickle chips and cheddar and jalapeno i know caden will love those he loves any kind of spicy hot pepper flavored anything <laughs> uh drinks we have a strawberry fanta a root beer and a pineapple fanta thought that was pretty neat i don't think i've seen those before uh paper towels y'all know my sparkle paper towels so i got those it's a six roll for five dollars uh i needed more shaving cream because i uh, started on the last can of it i guess today yeah today when i took my shower and shaved my legs i was almost out of hairspray that did not have my hairspray there which is kind of a bummer because i love my hairspray so I'm gonna give this a try, see how it is. Uh, cat food, I got 12 cans of the Nine Lives. It's got the Super Supper, uh, the meaty pate with real chicken and the meaty pate with real chicken and tuna. They're dry food, they were almost out of their dry food, so I just got this. It has salmon, tuna, chicken, and turkey in it. I think that big bag was like eight or nine dollars. I can't remember. Let me see how many pounds it is. Uh, it's 10 pounds. 10 pounds of cat food. I gotta get it put up before I turn them loose. They are locked in my half bath again because they try to break into my bread. Or they try to tear holes in the cat food bag. Anyway, that is all we got. And I've gotta get over here and get these pizzas put in the oven for our supper tonight. Okay, guys, y'all just have to look over my little um, Crayola marker <laughs> meal plan. Uh, and I had to put it in a notebook because I'm almost out of copy paper. And this cat will not leave me alone. He thinks I'm wanting to pet him right now. I'm just trying to go over my meal plan, Stormy. Stop. I'll get it up here. Maybe he'll leave it alone. All right. Sunday, which is tomorrow. Um, I always start my week out on Sunday. Uh, breakfast, I'm going to do some homemade cinnamon rolls if we don't lose power <laughs> because uh, we're supposed to be having a winter storm come in. So, hopefully we won't lose power. Uh, lunch will be fish sticks and fries. I had some fish sticks left over from last week that we didn't use. So, I'm going to do that for tomorrow for lunch. Supper will be hamburgers and fries. Monday, breakfast will be sausage gravy, eggs, and biscuits. Lunch will be ham and cheese wraps, just like on a tortilla wrap. Uh, supper will be Hidden Valley Potato Casserole, and I might do a Cook With Me. I can lay this back down because he went in there now. I uh, may do a Cook With Me for this video, the Hidden Valley Potato Casserole. It is so good. My kids absolutely love it. My husband loves it. It is, it is super good. Uh, Tuesday, breakfast will be the homemade banana chocolate chip muffins. My kids really love that. Lunch will be pizza and chips. Supper will be spaghetti and garlic bread. I'll probably just do some like garlic toast because I got a lot of bread. Uh, Wednesday, breakfast will be egg in a hole. Lunch will be leftovers or ramen because I'm sure we'll have leftovers from spaghetti and possibly that, but I doubt it. Um, where did I get to? Okay, supper on Wednesday night. Y'all know that's church night. Thursday, I'm going to be super busy on Thursday. Paisley gets her braces on Thursday. So, um, I'll probably get up. I can't, I think her appointment's at 10 o'clock. Probably get up and do some sausage and biscuits so she'll have a good breakfast before she goes. Because I know her little mouth's going to be sore after that. So, um, lunch, the other kids uh, will have sandwiches and chips. Supper will be chicken pot pie because she'll probably will be able to eat that too. It's soft. And I'm going to stop Thursday because I'll be near Aldi and do my groceries for the next week. And I'm possibly going to pick her up some pudding and soups and stuff like that. That'll help her with her little mouth. Uh, Friday breakfast will be pancakes and bacon. She could probably eat the pancakes, just not the bacon. Lunch will be um, chicken. I found some of the um, dinosaur chicken, I guess it is, at uh, Piggly Wiggly. So... We'll do chicken and mac and cheese. 
don't know if she'll be able to eat the chicken, but I'm sure she'll be able to eat the mac and cheese. Supper will be pizza night because it's Friday, so we always do pizza night on Fridays. Alrighty, Saturday, um, breakfast will be breakfast hash brown casserole. Um, I might do another cook with me on that. I don't know. We'll just see. I, I, I have no plans for this week on my videos, so... Probably just going to be a lot of day in the life this next week. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe some surprises in there. We don't know. Lunch will be homemade Lunchables. And supper will be the slow cooker uh, chicken stuffing, green beans. And then I'll do some probably mashed potatoes. Some mac and cheese. And I have some leftover rolls that I, are still frozen in the freezer from Christmas. Um, the Rhodes rolls. I didn't use all of them. So probably just thaw some of those out and cook them. And that is my meal plan for this week. All right, y'all, that's going to be it for my video today. I hope you enjoyed this grocery haul. Um, if you did, give it a thumbs up. I would really appreciate that. If you're new to this channel and you have not subscribed already, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. We would love for you to join our YouTube family. We do day in the lives. We do farm work. Um, I've got probably a video coming up. I turned my Easter egg or chickens out. They've grown so much since I've gotten them. But we do farm life, we do homeschooling, we do rodeos, we do lots of things. So, I've got some more upcoming videos coming up. Um, don't have anything planned for this week on some videos, so I'll probably just do some cook with me's days in the lives. Or day in the lives, and uh, I know I do have another grocery haul coming up probably for you on Friday, if nothing happens. Uh... I don't know. We'll just wing it this week. I have no plans. <laughs> anyway, I know that's not very good, but whatever. Because we're supposed to have some rough weather. And so if I don't get any videos out, you know, we've probably lost power or internet service. So, because we are on satellite internet. And when it gets nasty out, our satellite goes out. So, it is what it is. Gotta live with what I gotta live with to live out in the country. Anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see y'all in my next one. Bye.